Hi guys, today we are going to make a baby boy and a baby girl cupcake topper. Let us start with flattening up a flesh fondant for their faces. Make sure that it is thin enough so that it will not be overpowering the cupcake. Get a circle cutter and then cut as many as you have to. But for this tutorial, I'll just be making one of each. You can do this if you think that you have to smoothen off the edges. And then set it aside. Get a pink and blue fondant, one for baby boy and one for baby girl. Of course, you can also use a different color if you want to. Flatten both of them. You can also flat them at the same time so that you can make sure they are about the same thickness. And then use a slightly bigger circle to cut for this bonnet. You might have to put the circle back and forth a lot of times because it's, it will be hard to remove it, but try to remove it gently. Set it aside to dry. And then keep some of the flattened fondant because we will be using it later. Use another circle cutter to cut the bonnet just like this. Use the part that you cut on the pink fondant so that this will be a guide for our blue fondant. This will help us keep our designs uniform. It should look something like this. Place the blue and pink fondant on top of the face. Position them properly first before putting edible glue. This way, it will be easier for us to change it later on if we made a mistake. If you are liking our video tutorial for today, please like and subscribe to our channel. When you are happy with the position, use the smaller cutter to cut the bonnet. Using this technique, it will look like the bonnet is wrapping around the head. For me, it just looks better other than just putting it on top. With the excess fondant that we saved a while ago, cut a strip on the fondant around 1 cm each. One for the pink and one for the blue should be fine. And then put them together just like this. This way we can make sure that they are identical. Of course, it's not mandatory, but this will make it more beautiful. Use a ruler to mark your fondant just like this. This is just an added design for your bonnet. When you're done, put it on top of the bonnet just like this. And then use the same circle to cut it. And then repeat the same process for the baby boy. With the excess fondant that we have a while ago, create two small circles for the pacifier.
and then a smaller one that will go on the top. Put a little bit edible glue and put the smaller circle on top of the bigger circle. And then just put it on the mouth just like this. For the other circle that we did, make it a round fondant and put it on top of the bonnet. Using a circle cutter, we can make sure that they are about the same size. And then, get a black fondant and create the circle for the eyes. You can use a paintbrush to help you release the fondant when it gets stuck. Roll it using your fingers and flatten it gently on the top of the face. Do the same thing for the baby boy. Take the flesh fondant again and cut a small circle for the nose. And then just place it on the middle. Don't forget to put edible glue. When you are happy with it, let us now start with the feet. I have this silicone mold. Um, I suggest you have to buy this as well. It's very easily available in any cake decorating shops. Fill the entire space with fondant. And cut it gently on the top. And then just repeat the process depending on how many feet that you need. Make the baby boy's feet as well. And that's how we make a baby boy and baby girl cupcake topper. If you like our video tutorial for today, please like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you!